Hola everybody and welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for stopping by. If you're new here, my name is Lisa and welcome to Our Gray House. Today's project is another Dollar Tree DIY. For this project you will need some wood cutouts, you will need some clothespins, you'll need some paint pens to decorate the wood cutout stickers. I also recommend using some hot glue to make sure that those stickers stay on the clothespins. We have been in our house for over a year now, it was a year in March, and we didn't really put up that much decor in the first year, and now we're starting to put up decor. So, I'll set all that to say this. See this lovely sign behind me? It says, grandkids make life grand. My granddaughter made it for me. One of my granddaughters, Kennedy. Hey Kennedy, hey girl, <laughs> what's up? And so, um, it's got little clothespins so that we can put, you know, their pictures, like attach their picture. I thought it would be fun to kind of zhuzh up those little clothespins. I have some extra clothespins on hand and those are in my stash. And then I also found these stickers at the Dollar Tree and you get a bunch of them. These, these have the palm trees, the flip-flops, and pineapples. And this set has oranges, watermelon, and pineapple. So what I thought was I would just decorate some of, using my paint pens, I would just kind of color in some of these and then glue them to the clothes pens. I think I'm going to paint these white too. You'll first need to paint these the color of your choice. I'm painting mine white. Just putting a light coat of paint on the other side of these little clothespins. It doesn't have to be perfect. You're not really going to be looking at the clothespins necessarily, but I just like them to have a good neutral color from which I guess the, the color of the clothespins in general is neutral, but you guys know what I mean. As you can see, I've already kind of started coloring in, decorating these little stickers that I'm gonna be putting on top of these little clothespins. And what I'm just trying to do is make it look like apples, watermelons, I mean, oranges, watermelons, and pineapple. And the, the stickers are not necessarily stuck on uh, well, I mean, they're stuck on well, but you've got to kind of hold them if you're messing with them so that way it's not just wobbling all over the place. And I got this set of stickers, as I mentioned before, and I'll put it in the description box below if they still have them online. But I got these for a dollar, and I'm going to use them to decorate my entryway, the uh, little thing that Kennedy made for me. Hey, Kennedy, if you're watching.
how my little stickers turned out. I think they look fun and I think they look like summer type fruit. So I think that's going to be fun. Now we're going to attach those stickers here. They do have a little sticky thing on the back, but I'm also going to use my hot glue gun to get the job done. Pop this little sticker off and I'm going to put a little dab of glue right here. Not too much. And y'all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, I hope you give it a thumbs up and subscribe because I do a DIY video every Tuesday and Friday and I sprinkle some hot chocolate chats and other vlogs in between. I hope you have an awesome day. Don't forget if you want to follow me on Instagram or YouTube, it's Our Gray House, but just don't follow me in real life though because that's creepy. Bye!